All right, I guess we're gonna go see what uh, Uncle Aaron wants. Or I guess we want to see what Miles wants with Uncle Aaron. I don't know. Aaron ironed. Wait, Aaron. Aaron ironed an iron hey, urn. Is that how that goes? Iron. No, Aaron earned an iron urn. Iron urn. Iron urn. Fantastic accents in Baltimore. You'll love to see it. All right, what are we doing here, Aaron? I gotta call you back. Oh. Hi, right, Miles. Spill it. Give me the whole situation. Finn, Roxon, underground. It's just a lot, you know. You're 17. You're stressed, and you're a superhero. You gotta cut yourself some slack. You still making beats? Not much since I started this. Work-life balance, kid. Most important thing. Here. Little project your dad and I started back in the day. Our mixtape. Had rhymes ready and everything. <laughs> How come I never heard about this? Because we never finished. We sampled street noise around the way. Wanted the city to be our beat. But your dad had the masters. And after things went bad between us. <sighs> but you could finish what we could. Plus, it'll take your mind off work. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What do I do? Load that up. I'll walk you through it. I'll set up holograms to guide you. Scan the source. Holograms, huh? Okay, don't think about Finn. Focus on sounds. Clear my head. Scan the holograms, and it'll unlock files on that drive I gave you. Hope you figure out which sound you're looking for. What the hell? Wait, what? Now try and find the original sound, and grab a clean sample. It's like an alarm or something. Wait. What? Keep looking. Too far. Surely it's like a dinghy or something, right? Too close? Need to get a little further away so it doesn't distort. This is weird. Am I too far? Too far? Need to be a little closer to get your levels right. Wait, what was that? But not quite what we're looking. Not a match. This is good sound, but it's muffled. Try and get a clear line of sight. Why do you need to see the sound? That doesn't make any sense. Wait, what was that? Was there something over here? Source blocked. Yeah, see, I was gonna say it's probably a dinghy. I was right. There you go. Yeah, 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 that's it. What in the fuck? What is this? Oh, dope. <laughs> Not now. Hey. Get some you like? Yeah, really unique dynamics. See, old man still knows his stuff. <laughs> and you were right about clearing my head, too. I know what to do about Finn. I gotta see her. Try to talk her out of all this. In person? Where? Trinity Church. Tomorrow night. Why so interested? Because you got a target on your back the size of Jersey. You don't have to protect me. Someone should. You know, you said you never finished this tape because of how things went bad between you and Dad. What actually happened between you two? It was complicated. We were too similar and too different. 
Finish the tape. Get all the samples. And you'll hear the whole story. Promise. All right. Thanks, Unc. Trinity Church. Remember, Tinker is yours. But leave the boy alone. What is this a poster okay. for? Just the concept of hip hop? As soon as I'm ready to go. Bizarre. Should I look at my apartment? Glad my gear survived the move. No, I already looked Wish at this. I don't want to look at that. Go away. Stop it. Me and Finn could definitely use your advice. Who doesn't love an ohm meter? Nobody. That too. Mom? Genki? Anyone home? Nope. It's just me. So just creep around in your mom's room. That's mom's uh, room's starting to look like mom's room. Definitely what you want to do. Bathroom's been a little crowded with me, mom, and Genki all here. There's not really anything interesting looking to to look at here. What's this? Bridge attack didn't slow mom down at all. Wanted to let you sleep. I'm at campaign headquarters. Text if you need me, Mama. Kind of nice to have the apartment to myself. What's this? Hard to think of Ma as a little kid. I mean, he's much taller than that now. They gotta update that. Mom's killing it. No way she's gonna lose. I mean, she kind of has to, right? There's no way she wins. Level me up, baby. Yeah. The rest of the sounds you need are spread across what? the city. Okay, so there's Prowler stuff now. Maybe I'll just spend an entire video and just do all those, because that can't take too long, right? Surely. Where's this rocket? Venom rocket. Off the wall attacks cause Venom stun. Nah. What's that? Finishers generate 40% of it. Why not do that one? All right. Time to call Finn. Hope she answers. Hi. Spider-Man. Finn. Hey. We need to talk. In person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please. Meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies. I promise. If you're screwing with me... Fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay. Trinity Church. Let's go. Alright, so... I said this, uh, when I played this last, but I think I'm actually gonna just... take an entire video... to just do all this stuff. Well, what are all those guys doing up on that building? There's no reason for that. I don't need to be there. Sorry, not doing that crime either. Do not care. So let me see, how is this built up? This is 64% done. Maybe like at the end of this or something, I'll um, go do the friendly neighborhood app stuff or maybe I'll just do that, you know, off screen. Like no one's going to see that. Because, yeah, that's like really the only significant thing that I have uh, left is the Friendly Neighborhood app. That one has two, that one has three. And there aren't a ton of side missions, but I guess the Friendly Neighborhood app stuff are side missions, so. Hey man, great news. Shutting down those rocks on labs put a serious dent in their reactor production plans. That is great news. They may not be done for good yet. We just saved a ton of people. Celebratory hot dogs are on me next time I see you. 
<laughs> I'll take it. Thanks, man. Oh, I could go for a New York hot dog. A dirty water dog, specifically. It used to be a tradition every time I went to New York. Your dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay. Something where Stop talking so I can fucking listen to the sandball. It's just like static. Too far. Source blocked. Okay, so I can just go down. I didn't need to just stay up there. Too far. God damn, that guy was just gonna keep going. That doesn't look quite right. Boy, these are fun. Source blocked. What is over here that's blocked? There's a subway line near here. That could be it. Thank you for just telling me, Miles. Because the crackling could be of like train tracks. I think it's back there. He's back where? Fucking weirdo, Miles. Where is their subway line? Hmm. There's a subway line near here. I understand you said that. Wait. Look for the subway entrance. That guy just fell down for no reason. Did they just say shoot a web? God, these guys are vicious in this game. Okay, that's outside. Wow! Here it is, right here. Get close enough to record it. Wait, do I go down? No. Because <laughs> that just does that, right? Did that exit the mission? No. Is there another... Oh. Get close enough to record it. Durr. So, ready to record. There you go. Yeah, that's it. You probably don't know this, but your dad and I grew up not far from here. Before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Hearing the clatter of the wheels, the squealing when the trains turn or stop. Always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space alien. Your dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker, but he always wanted to help you. Yeah, sounds like that. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and say, don't put this subway here. If the actual solution is this, because that's uh, a little unfair. I'm just gonna go ahead and say that. That's pretty ridiculous. Because if, I, if he's saying the trains, the thing I'm going to think to look at is the trains. It just happened to be the wrong trains. So that's kind of lame. Oh, uh, we got here. Of course. This is the Danicast with our debate. That's your intro? Lame! We in the business call that burying the lead. Hype it up. Let me ask you something, Danny. Do you ever think about what you're inciting? About your journalistic integrity? More than some. Because your campaign against Roxxon is baffling to an... What the fuck was that? Also, by the way, before that one started, I was literally going to say... They still haven't done that uh, debate yet. Conspiracy theories, is this the debate? Because your campaign against Roxxon is baffling to an actual journalist like myself. You should be attacking the young, unproved vigilante who keeps causing problems in Harlem. What? You, you twist everything Spider-Man does into something malicious while simultaneously excusing everything Roxxon does wrong. All Spider-Man needs for you to support him is to get a better PR department. Uh-uh. 
Uh-uh, uh-uh. The only problem Spider-Man fixes are the ones he causes. I won't praise the arsonist for putting out his fire. Meanwhile, Roxxon built a beautiful plaza in a failing neighborhood. By tearing down homes and businesses, our new Spider-Man is proving that Harlem isn't the failure Roxxon makes it out to be. And you, Mr. Jameson, for someone who claims to love New York, you sure do seem to hate New Yorkers. You are clearly emotional, young lady, so I'm invoking the mercy rule on this debate. Jared, shut it down! And whose idea was it to debate a teenager? There are no good optics to destroying a child! Get the car! I need a hot stone massage! Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah, he, he's gone. Well, thanks for the debate that you demanded, Mr. Jameson. To everyone else, remember to stand up every half hour while working at a computer. Bye! Uh, that one should have been like a multi-part one, I think. They should have kept going, they should have actually had a debate. This is a good one. Me and your dad used to hang around here. Listen while the whole station came alive. That's what you need. Something at the station. Um, is it? No. It's like a fan. It's back there. It's, it sounds like a fan or something. Okay, so these guys are in here. Maybe it's literally just as easy as this one. It is, okay. Fire truck engine. It will play. I think hanging around here is how your dad got the idea to be a cop. I said, man, you're not uptight enough for that job. He wanted to make things better from the inside. Pretty sure he died trying. You did make things better, Dad. And so will I. How do you look at firefighters, a noble profession, where no one, no one hates firefighters for good reason, and you go, I'm going to be a cop instead? I don't know how that happens. It's pretty wild. That guy wanted something. I still haven't exactly figured out what the green people do, but but I also haven't seen one in like hours. So I'm just gonna assume that they all go away. Sorry Thank guys. Merry Christmas, Spider Man. <laughs> Imagine seeing Spider Man fall from the sky and that's your response. This one was all your dad's idea. You need something that's always in this park. Quiet on their own. Loud in a group. Yeah, I wonder what this one is. Oh, wait, no, you're gonna scare them off. Hmm. Fucking Spider Man. I mean, I guess it could be that. But no, those are definitely pigeons. Right, how the hell do I, uh. get the pigeons to come back? Okay, there they are. Too far. Let's get close, but not too close. Alright, guys, come on. You can do this. What the fuck? Maybe it's not. Maybe it is this guy. But it's saying I'm too close to this guy. Okay, so it's definitely- oh, I know what I'm doing. Duh. I forgot that he had this ability. I feel like they can still sense me. Come on, bro, there you go. Hey guys, look, I'm back. This was way back, before high school. We were hanging in the park one day, and someone dropped a hot dog. You know how that goes. Place was swarming with pigeons. Your dad stopped cold. He said, Aaron, man, try some music. Listen. Next day, we were crawling all over Manhattan looking for beats. Like you are now. I remember the first time they showed me how to sample. Uncle Aaron had the gear, and Dad had the ear for music. Okay. I feel like, um... I don't know, this is kind of a weird series of side missions. I'm just gonna 
put that one out there. Lay that down on there on the table there. Oh, it's JJ. Folks, I've heard differing opinions from my discerning listeners about Roxxon's security force. On the one hand, this is fair. There are some of the same concerns I have about Spike. These are not law enforcement officers and do not answer to the same standards. On the other hand, Roxxon has every right to protect its property and interests. And many of the skirmishes people are concerned about started because Spider-Man broke and entered into Roxxon's places of business. Now I'm told these incidents have died down. But I ask you, if a stranger in a skin-tight suit burst into your bedroom at night, what would you do? No, no wait, that was rhetorical. Jared, shut down the comments. You people are sick! Interesting. Can we stop, Spider-Man? Thank you. Thank you very much. Your mom lived here right after college. You know that? She and your dad were dating. Three of us spent a lot of time here. We got used to this soft, steady beat. Soft beat. Man, that sounds bright. Awesome. What the hell is this one? Is it this train? It can't be, certainly, right? Because that's making a, uh, a very distinct noise that is clearly not boink, boink, boink. Um, like, what the hell is it? Source blocked too far. Am I sure it's not this one? Come on, Miles. Look for the source. I am currently looking for the source. It's gonna tell me too far, Rhythm. too... Rhythm. Rhythm, yeah. Maybe that water tower. It's water tower? Get close enough. Why would they throw all this stuff at me in here? Like the train... And then, hey, green lady. I was just talking about you. Okay, you're excited to see me. Hi, how's it going? I'm in combat mode, apparently. I'm not in greet civilian mode. So, I guess that lady's just not gonna... Not gonna have anything to say. Okay, so it is this. Oh, it's the dripping. Yeah, it's subtle, but a good beat. Things were good back then. Felt like they'd be good forever. Your mom got her first gig as a teacher. Your dad was new to being a cop. And I just started calling myself a prop. I figured we all kept secrets about our jobs. But last, though, your dad's job and mine crossed paths too often. Man, Uncle Aaron, if you would have been anything else, my mom and dad would have supported you all the way. Yeah, but it's cooler to be the prowler. I mean, I'd be the Prowler. It's a cool name. Got a cool suit. No, I'm not going over there, lady. Sorry, I'm not interested. <laughs> Me, you, dog. Carly Howard, Terrell Santiago, and Verona Swanson. Uh, I don't know, movie looks bad. Find good tidings under our tree. Burgers and hot dogs. Times Square. Easy to find someone in the crowd here. Or lose it. Sounds you need like an electric current. A current? I could cheat it with venom. <laughs> nah. So, wait, I don't even hear this one. Yeah, I don't know. I can't quite... It's probably one of the, uh... Billboards, right? If not even just this one right here, literally. That I'm looking at immediately. Too close. Alright, then let's get on top of this building. Jesus. Oh, it's this. No, Spider-Man. 
still too close. I'm stupid. Cool. Love how alive that feels. After I started calling myself a problem, met my first client right under this sun. Neon flags hard to miss. The crowd makes it easy to blend in. She wanted me to steal a painting. I looked across the square and saw your dad looking back at me. Never said anything. Just turned and left. He didn't know everything. Just that I was a thief. That was enough. I think he saw when you were heading long before I did. If he would have tried to act right sooner, he would have forgiven you. I know he would have. All right, what else? Got one here. Same time next week. <laughs> Shut up. Is that lady talking to me? What do you mean same time next week? What the hell? What's going on with you, man? Wait, 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 wait. Is this also right where No, this is a different church. Get off the wall. themselves a new class of criminal, the young mafia, if you will. They wanted respect, so they went after the crime families. The conflict sputtered out when Hammerhead staged the full-on takeover of the Magia, which indirectly saved the underground. Thanks for that, Hammerhead, jerk. Till next time, if you're trying to change your habits, limit yourself to one change per month so you can stick to it. Goodbye. Okay. I'll change as often as I want, God damn it. Always feels like someone celebrating, even when it's just telling time. Yeah, I wonder what that one is. Also, too, so we had to include it. A sound that tells time. Okay. How am I too close to this one? Whoopsie Daisy. Was it right here? Look for the source. I see it. Wow, that one was hard. That's it. Ringing on the hour. When I hear those bells, I remember the last time I was here. Your dad had just graduated from the police academy. I didn't go to the ceremony, so I met him here after. Bought us milkshakes. Strawberry for him, peanut butter for me. I don't know why I remember that. He said he couldn't cover for me anymore if I got in trouble. I told him I was done with that life. I was lying. Why do you keep changing the suit? believed me for a while. Or at least pretended to. Man, things got complicated between them. 